The love seat. An intimate little sofa. A cozy place for two. Kind of quaint in an old-fashioned sort of way. A safe place to talk, to laugh, to share your secrets. The love seat. No matter where we are or who we're talking to, could it be the starting point for an open conversation? What could it possibly have to say? About family? About schools? About what matters most? The All Pro Dads Day and I'm on Morning Breakfast programs are all about family and school and what matters most. Every month in 1,600 schools across the country, 144,000 mothers, fathers, and children gather in cafeteria chairs to talk, to laugh, to build memories, all over a simple breakfast. I've been a chapter leader for four years now, and I've seen firsthand the impact on what matters most. But don't just take it from me. Have a seat. Tell us your story. The parenting aspect it brings and the importance that it places on family. And, um, you know, we deal with many families at Bernie that are not intact families. We have lots of single moms and just lots of issues out there. So it was an opportunity for us to bring some parenting, really rich parenting uh, ideas here for our families. We started with about maybe 75 people there, kids and dads. We're now averaging maybe 250. That lunchroom is jam-packed. The dad traffic through the hallways at that school was marginal at best when we started. You count the amount of dads that are walking those hallways now and you will lose count. Our goal was to build a rapport with our families to make them feel welcome here. We need our families. We know how important it is to have that bond and to work together as a team to do what's best for our children. So with iMom, they come, we have breakfast, we talk, it's informal. They're able to see their students in a different light. And then they come for conference night, they come to volunteer, and we love having our families on campus. It's been great. And every time you go to a first iMom, it's that nervousness of what if no one shows? And then regardless if they have 550 or 500 there, the feeling that the leader has afterwards of, I impacted those families, and they're not the same as when they walked in the door, and they're having a conversation that we started here. It's just really powerful to watch. That first Alper Dad meeting that I had, where I had all those dads show up there, and then I started seeing the influence that I could have in their life, it really Alper Dads propelled me into where I am today. It kind of shot me back up in life again and gave me a purpose again. I think one of the strongest pieces of iMoms and All Pro Dads is when, the, and, and I know the first time we saw it, I sat off to the side and just just teared right up. But to see all those moms and dads stand up with their children and tell that audience why they're so proud of these children. I have seen some children's little faces just light up. I think for some of our guys, it's probably perhaps the first time they've heard their parents compliment them and, and express pride in those children. And it's really, really important. Our PTA is getting the support it needs because our families are comfortable, because they're coming to our iMom breakfast and our All Pro Dad. So it's been the link that we've really needed to get everybody involved. From an administrator standpoint, the principal is just a total supporter of this program because she knows that an involved dad means better performing kids. 93% of America's children attend a public school. So there's no place that you can make an impact on the next generation like you can in a public school. And the fact that All Pro Dad and iMom can bring the family first message into public schools and do so every single day is an incredibly powerful tool um, to reach the next generation with our message and our values.